welcome to our first episode of Wine Down Wednesday. Woohoo! How y'all doing today? Toast? Chia. Queen Ferris, Tony cheese, D. Cheese, cheese. Welcome, welcome. I'm so glad you guys are here today. We're really excited to kick off our first episode. Thank you guys for joining in. Remember to subscribe to Just Simply Rose and put your notification bell on so you know when these videos drop. All right, um, you want to introduce yourself, Mayo? Well, hello, 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 people of the world. I am London Ferris. Yes, I'm here soon with my, to be. Soon to be Miss London Lane. Oh, excuse me. You can me. check me out. <laughs> oh, let's see what's... Uh -huh, uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. It's a I'm a little blinded to the right, a little blinded to the left. You yes. know, you my joy, you know, <laughs> Work. I need everybody. Work I, need everybody. <laughs> I need everybody. I need everybody. We need to work on him. Yes, we need to work on yes. him. Yes. 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 Uh, I'm a hairstylist here in Las Vegas. You can find me on Instagram at London Ferris BB. Yes. And Nephew, let's go. Oh, man. Oh. What do I even say about myself? Um, exactly. How about them <laughs> eyebrows? Okay. Oh, well. <laughs> you look at all yummy and scrumptious. Mm -hmm. They all natural. <laughs> can you see me? I can't we see can me. see. Yeah. We can, can you see, see enough of me? Oh, oh get it. Yeah, yes. You might want to. Won't you give them a view? You. Okay. Won't you give them a view? Tony B. Oh. Yes. Oh. Yes. Oh. Yes. Oh. <laughs> I love it. I love it. I love it. Oh, I love yes. this line. Tony B, yes. you look almost like your mama. Oh, right. <laughs> oh, this is a family fair, y'all. Yes, yes, yes. And we're so glad you guys are here. Well, we got two topics on this episode that we're going to be talking about. And the first one is going to be social dilemma. Have y'all seen that? Oh, my God. Girl. I did see it. I oh, heard about it away. first. Okay. I saw it. I heard about it first. And then I saw it. What's your take on it? Listen, when I watched it, I was like, do I tell other people to watch this? Because isn't that like going on social media and kind of stirring it? <laughs> right, and I was like, right. wait, I'm trying to go against the curve. Right. But people just tried to, people watched it anyway and they're all like, did you watch it? I was like, I did. <laughs> I did. We're being right. bamboozled. Right, exactly. Like everything, the rest of 2020. Right, because everything involves social media. Everything. You know, what do you think about it? What was your take on it? Um, honestly. It's just kind of weird because one of the things that they were talking about is just like uh, how social media can play effect into like, you know, somebody's mental being or yep. somebody's mental health. It's and a real thing. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I can definitely say that for me, mm -hmm. um, it was something, is something that I have to take periodic breaks for Yeah. because mm -hmm. simply of like seeing the famous people with all the nice things and the fancy cars and the mm -hmm. nice clothes, it makes you want to say, good life. right, right, it right. makes you suffer inside, like, right. my life is just not good enough, right, 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 and they're the same age, like, celebrities, I don't even realize that they really are, like, the same age as me, like, 25, 26, 27, and they have all these nice things, and I'm just like, wow, I wish I had all that, <coughs> right. and then it puts you into, like, a depression, so like, I'm not there yet, exactly, right. I'm not there yet, I'm not there Why yet, don't you're I kind of comparing I mean, yourself, you are, because right. if I put a post up and it doesn't get over a hundred likes. Oh, Ooh, it was fail. Fail. And don't you you go on there and you check, check. it. It's like you looking at it and you're like, okay, I'm not gonna check. I posted it. this six hours ago. <laughs> Why I only got three likes? Why I only got 50 <laughs> likes? Let me see. Okay. okay. I thought I was cute. Two. Okay. It's like, um and one of you, them is not enough. But yeah. you know what? You know what the bad part about it is once you actually post something and you know how many of your friends and family you got on there? Then you can't tell me you don't catch your attitude. I think you like, attitude. he know <laughs> he I saw my him. post and he didn't even I like it. My sisters were <laughs> because I, was, I had posted something and I'm a hairstylist, so I'm trying to post my business and everything like that. And they didn't share it automatically. I had to ask them to right, share it. Right. Right. But yet, you're sharing everybody else's everybody stuff. Everybody else's. Everybody so else's. So, yeah, it gives you an attitude like, you don't know this game. Like, do it, do it, do it. But. Right. It just it is what it's, it is. It's so bad. I left it alone. It's bad. And, <laughs> right. and in the um in the documentary, um I wrote down a couple things on our cards that I felt like we can touch on because it was really oh. crazy. So they talked a lot about 
how it increases, uh, they've seen an increase in suicides. And what's crazy is I, I see it both ways. I see it more with young, impressionable, not even just young, but people who are in, in a certain mental state. Listen. You know what I mean? That in middle school. Right. That part right there. Right. I don't bullying. Think they, I don't even bullying. think they have social media. Yeah. Bullying on there causes suicide. Oh. Didn't they have something? Um, a boy actually, didn't he kill himself on, on Facebook? He actually, did you I guys think he hung himself, maybe? He, he actually dogs? went live. I think so. Yeah. I didn't hear about that. Yeah. It was, it was so little... crazy that you hear about it and you just kind of like pass it on. To right. The thing. But it has a real effect because if we're dealing with depression as adults, they don't, they don't even know how to deal with that. Right. Exactly. At all. They don't know how to they deal with so that. They got so many other things and that they're trying they're to get with. likes and they're right. trying to get this and they're comparing the Y'all, I ain't got classmates. COVID. Like, I, I sucked down my wine a little wrong, so uh, I ain't got COVID one nine, okay? <laughs> not the COVID like cough. coughing. Not the COVID <laughs> cough, girl. Okay. We gotta be aware. But it is, it's, it's, <laughs> I see it. And like, you have to strip your kids away from it because like, listen. But then how do you do it? How do you do it? Because you know what? I need my damn time. I'm old. True. Okay? Listen, I I'm don't old. mind when he's on the... <laughs> The game and the I take away at night mostly. <coughs> well, you you limit it, but I'm telling you what. And they have a. They it's have like a babysitter time. for real. If yeah. I'm a hundred, I'm Listen. like, okay, go ahead. My son's and on I know punishment right now. He <laughs> is attached to his phone. Listen, as my well. son is on punishment right now. From he has nothing to do. Oh, he'll, he, oh, just, he but he just want to come mind. bother me. <laughs> All right, and you want where your phone? So Oop, you're on punishment. You Damn. want so bad to say, oh, you know what? It wasn't that bad. Go and get your phone. I always give it early. You want to talk to me? Oh, no, don't worry about it. Go get your phone. <laughs> and, it's, and it and it sucks, but we we can't go outside like we used to, right? You don't right. even want your kids to go outside, so you right. just leave them the phone because of safety. They're there, right? You could see them. Right. When, when I was a kid, I went outside. Me right. Too. I played around the block all day. I was mm -hmm. out until the light, the street long. lights come on. Didn't have a phone. Worry, didn't worry didn't have a phone. You worry about what age now. did you even get a phone? Ten, eleven. And then even that, it was for school. Yeah. yeah. So it was a brick. It couldn't do nothing yeah. anyway. It was like a Nokia. <laughs> I didn't have no phone. Shit, I didn't have a phone till twenty five. I'm about to say in our no twenty five. And I'm older than you. It was a Nokia. You. It wasn't a. And then text message didn't really mm -hmm. come on until no. where was I? Text. Text message. Was oh, you know we had pages. Two thousand and six <laughs> when somebody sent me my first text, and I was like. Hmm. What is this? Right. Why are you just ain't calling me? Right. And now, don't call me. You better text me. Text me. It's just... And that, and that's the other thing too. We lost I've changed. all personable. And then the text messages. I'm a horrible texter. You get, you can misconstrue what somebody's oh, saying. Big time. The so tone. if you the tone, you don't know the tone. I always feel like London is mad at me. Everybody <laughs> does. I, I had to get that. And when you said it, I said, that's how the heck it is. She just like one word. And I'm like, oh, okay, and I'm I, like, I don't send her a whole okay. book. Oh, listen, and I'm she's a, like, yeah. Like I said, I am a horrible texter, right? Because I'm just, it's chatting to me, right? So I'm not going to write you nothing long. Or if I got to say something, I want you to hear me. Right. Because I don't know how to write how I sound. And you right. know, I'm sounding like I have high energy. I'm happy majority of the time. Right. You know what I'm pissed. Right. You'll right. read it. That's when you get a long book. If See, I'm good. It's short and right. sweet, but I'd rather FaceTime and see your face right. and talk to you. You could talk to me, we could laugh, we could kiki, but if it's text message, it's just short to the point where I'm usually doing something. So see, now I like this. it for exactly what you're saying because if I don't feel like having a whole conversation, I can get back I to it. text. You know what I mean? There's and video chatting though. To, but then you stay on it. No, not with um video chatting. It's just you can say your little message oh, and go that. on Marco Polo. Oh, that. It's the best right. thing. I mean, I don't have to stay there right. like FaceTime. Right. I can get back to your message, but you can I can hear your That's tone. That's right. I forgot about Marco I had Polo. somebody send me a long message and she was she was upset. I said, I'm not going to write all this back. You're going to hear me so right. you can understand what I'm saying. What I'm even, saying and where I'm coming but from. But even when I speak, sometimes it's like, are you mad? Right. No, this is just how I am. Right. That's <laughs> like, exactly. I'm really, really, really happy. I'm just direct. That's right. And and so to touch on a couple other, well, I wrote down a few things. And one was um, the impression that social media makes on kids. And um, the other one that it was talking about is what, when you go on a totally different like website and plug something in and then you can go to Instagram. So say you go shopping. Mm -hmm. If I go on Kirkland's and I want to go 
get something. I can go on Instagram and the same items there and I'm like, or I'll get an email or like a notification that says, shh, I saw you was looking at this, it's on sale. If I want to, this is what I'm gonna start doing. Like, if I want to go on a trip, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. I'll start announcing where I want to go, just so my phone can pick up places. Oh, you should visit here. You should. And visit these announce some money. Ask have... for the money too. Right. True. <laughs> True. Like, who, announce you should the go dollars. Here. Like, how much okay, it is? Thank you for my idea. So, a, I don't have to look. You know what I mean? Because you're telling me right now. I know right. y'all listening. Right. Uh, my fiance. I have a uh, uh, my fiance. I have uh, what do I have? What is it? Alexa in our room? He was like the government is watching. I said you talk yeah. on this phone. What is this? <laughs> okay, it is for the it's it's horrible for young kids. It really is. Talk about your experience that you just had on camera. On camera, you don't have to mention any names. Are you talking about the thing with the paper? I just yes. Showed you? Tell me what happened. Crazy, crazy, crazy. So basically, I it was weird because I got a certified letter from the district attorney, and I was just like, okay, mm -hmm. that's interesting. But I missed the package, so I went to go pick it up. I think it was yesterday, the day before yesterday, and um, I opened it, and they were basically just telling me that they were tracking, tracing my phone calls or listening on my phone. They tapped his phone from May something to June something. June 25th. For, yeah, for some crime that somebody committed. They were having your phone? His Mine. phone. For somebody else. Exactly, because I guess they had reason to believe that they had contact with me. I ain't know none of the people on that list. There's like five or six or seven names on there. I'm like, I don't know them people. I don't have that number. I don't know them people. I don't know what's going on, but they were listening to my phone. Tapped calls. his phone. And then you and know, after, that's legal. after, and this is September. It's just in September, the end of September. You can't do that, I thought. I... I thought you had to let somebody. Y'all let us know. You gotta is let somebody that legal know. or not? I don't know. You have to let somebody know. Okay, I'm filming you, right? They literally tapped his phone, and he just got the letter. What two or three days ago? I think they're the only. Government? It was from the district district attorney, but I think they're only allowed to do that if it's for a crime and they have to get permission. And they just only sent that because it's against the law. I would have thought that your know. name had to be involved in a crime, though. Not because okay. somebody might have dialed the wrong number or something like that. Apparently, I called this person a lot. I don't know who this person is, but, you know. That's crazy. So, they obviously, that's weird. nothing that's ever came of like it because he didn't know the person. He They didn't even contact him. It's done. It's like, we tapped your phone. We got to invade your privacy. You're have clean. a nice day. Oops. Have a nice day. They didn't even say anything about you clean, you're dirty, we thought you were this. It was just like, have a nice day. No further explanation. There's nowhere to go, America. Okay. You need to get the hell up out of America. Exactly. Exactly. It's so, all the I don't know. It's, I don't know if you can curse. Excuse my language, but it's all the it's, shit. Uh, listen, I did put out a disclaimer that this show is not for children. Okay, so I got a dirty mouth. It will get raw and ratchet. That's just As we progress. I was in the military. <laughs> okay. okay Air Force. <laughs> I, do, I do love the Lord. Okay. But listen, the Lord. I do use some choice words. Okay. Look, look, custom. <laughs> look, custom. <laughs> and now this last thing on um, what I saw on what they were saying on Social Dilemma is something that I think that we all most of us, I'm not going to say all because some people get offended, but we tend to validate ourselves. It touched on what we were talking about before with the likes mm -hmm. based on the social media. So if we put a pic out or even for me doing just simply Rose, make sure you subscribe. Do it girl. Do it. <laughs> Shout out. Shout okay. out. Even for me doing this. I, by human nature, look at my subscribers, look at my comments, look at how many people viewed my video, and I will, because it's still new, but I know that I'll get to the point where I will question myself, you know what I mean? I As like, is this something that, you know, yeah, is I, right for me? Is this something that I should do? Mind you, I know my drive and what I am determined to do. However, mm -hmm. that will play a big role. I had a YouTube channel. I started mine in, what, 
maybe six years ago, mm-hmm. and you're constantly looking like only thirty five people watch this. Right. All that work, all right. that editing, all right. that I'm putting music to it. I'm trying to make right. it look fresh. I'm trying to do that, and then it's just like that's it. I that's can't all? do this that's, because that's I'm spending so much <laughs> doing makeup tutorials. You're doing you're spending hours putting right. makeup, trying to show people how to, and then people are like, even in the comments, like, how do you put on eyelashes? <laughs> I did not this whole thing. Right. And you are about some eyelashes, but I get it. You know, right. they're asking what they need and all that stuff, but it's just, I feel like you two. But at least they ask. It's like, what about the other 12 million people yes. that should have seen it? You know, true. <laughs> I, but I feel like with this, you have to be consistent. Yeah. And, but you have to have a very strong base and understand. Tough skin, too. You have to. Tough you skin. have to. You have to be able to take the no's yep. or the people that don't watch it right. and just keep on going. I know keep on everything going. is you gotta not motivate for everybody. Yourself. Exactly. Really, you really got to motivate yourself. And you yourself. know what? Doing it, you don't really even see any rewards till way down the line. So Ooh, yeah. you have to don't know. Quit. That's okay? all I said. You, you have you to know. You can start back up because you know, yes. I shouldn't start and then I'll stop. Yeah. I'll yeah. start. And then I stop because I'll be like, oh, I'm not stopping. I'm going I'm, another way. <laughs> I'm going to I got made up my mind and this is going where it's supposed to go. But I feel like social media is here to stay. Right. It's not going anywhere. Right. We need to learn how to adapt to it and not let it overtake us. And understand exactly. that watching the social dilemma, right. what these people are doing to us. Oh, my gosh. Right. Yeah. He mm-hmm. said he said one thing. He's like, I was sitting, we were in a group meeting mm-hmm. trying to figure out how we make email more addicting right and they what? were making avatars based on people's you know what they were doing so that the avatars would tell them what to target us for yeah and then they, they were doing that yeah you show mm-hmm. them like okay we got them we got them go go send this i believe there's people out there doing that yeah. on these little stupid ass phones they are they are they I are to call and text that's it and look at that's the it. pictures listen that's if all. i could get a flip phone <laughs> Oh, you know, Samsung. I was going to tell you they got a badass flip phone. And I think it might be good so you don't see it. But it's $12,000 million, though. Oh, yeah. Well, you know. Yes. Flip phone is how much? It's, it's like phone. twelve or fourteen hundred dollars. You open it. It's badass. It's a though. flat screen. It's a, it's a regular That's screen. That's what I want. It opens up to something like this, and then yes. it folds right back down. Yes. I think it's I good. I saw that. I think it's good because you can see it. On one of the advertisements, because I was talking about a phone. <laughs> see how they got it? Man, my husband was talking about phones. Right there. there we go. But it's a flip phone. They're bringing it back. Yes, it's bad. Wow. It's bad. He's like, and it showed how it could fit in your purse. It is it bad. You. And it's, I go lit- it's literally like thirteen or fourteen hundred dollars. I want to go on marketing because it, it, they a got way, it. Like, ooh, let's get them to do this. Ooh, okay. Let's get them to do that. All right. Well, next we are going to talk about music videos. <laughs> so there's a certain someone in the room that has me hooked on someone named Santana's Back It Up. Saucy Santana. So I'm sorry. See, I don't know. Saucy. That's the New York. I'm sorry. Saucy Santana. Yeah, was the New York. <laughs> I heard it. <laughs> Back It Up and Don't Get Video. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to let you speak on this. <laughs> Listen. Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay, I'm addicted to the video because it took a while for me to even look at Santana, honestly. Mm -hmm. I think when he first started playing it, I would say, turn that off. I I don't want to see it. I don't really, okay, no, I don't really say turn it off because he plays whatever and Mm -hmm. it doesn't bother me. Mm -hmm. But I looked at him, I was like, okay, he has a nail. There's a lot going on. Yeah, there's a lot. Especially like the butt shaking and like right. the panties and the thongs and on him <laughs> and the beard <laughs> and on him and the beard. So it took a lot, but for... not even in like a homophobic way. More right, of just like a, oh no, it's just real. He has everything included. If you're gonna right. have the right. nails, go ahead and shave. You know what I'm saying? Shave the beard. I like the beard. I now. like the beard now. Let me tell you something. Uh-huh. Uh, it's growing on me. At first, I was like, if you don't wear makeup, <laughs> if you gonna wear makeup, take the beard off. But now, looking at him and watching, I was like, I that's like my dude that's now. That's like a trendsetter. I man. love it. Because, that's my hey, dude now. His makeup is bomb. Yeah. Always but nails is always and the on The beard point. is nicely trimmed. He always has his hair fresh cut. cut. Fresh I cut. love it that he's like, I'm finna, but I'm still a dude. So right. My hair still gonna be cut, faded yes. off. Don't let yes. it fool you. I got a beard, yes. but my makeup is popping, and yes. here go the nails too. Yes. And I'm all like. 
I can take it all. I'm right. with it. I, I love it. Uh, I want to be your friend. my dude now. I want to be your friend. He, he is that person. Yeah, and I'm I like surprised, it. I'm surprised, but he... You going to do the I love it. Me? Oh, I don't know. Why? Yeah, like why? 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 He's shy shy. right now. I'm a little shy. Y'all, he, a little shy. he gives me I'm not shy. the Santana Dude, leg. I'm sorry, the saucy tent Santana leg. And it gets me every time. But he's yeah, Maybe to later me. he'll to... be able to. <laughs> my, my jeans are too tight. <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing? Tight? Okay. <laughs> so can you get no skin. The little stretches. <laughs> So the next, okay, so real quick on Santana, my only thing was, I love the videos, I think that they're, for what they are, yeah. I just think when it comes to kids, it's going to give them a confusing How outlook so? on, on sexuality, because like I said, it's like which... Which it's like I'm not I'm confused doing. when I see heterosexual people doing stuff on TV. I no, 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 not his dancing. No, not no, his dancing. Oh, okay. I'm talking about if you want to be feminine, just what we were talking about. If you want to be feminine, be feminine. But he has like everything going on, and like I feel like about. that's what the world is going towards. Where you you're not so? you're not fitting in a box where you're saying you're yeah, straight, that's true. you're gay, you're whatever. I think that's it's true. just going to be all one big old. It's just one big I old color. But that. we I as adults, do what I want to do right. But we as adults get that. But how are the children that are confused? I think is okay. what I'm. Thinking I know about. I hear I hear this on like when I'm watching I'm on social media and they was like if you ask me if I'm a boy or if I'm a girl one more time right mm -hmm. and it's usually the guy that has makeup on and all that other stuff don't ask me if I'm a girl right that's where it gets a little confusing so what are they okay. supposed to ask okay. you know what I mean because right. they know that you are I have experience with that because when I used to have my little curly wig mm -hmm. the little short one I had people How ask me if I was transsexual um what, what is your views on that and what do you want them to ask you. Or do you I mean, want them to mind their business. I mean, that's <laughs> Amen. <one. laughs> Hello. <laughs> that's Hello. Fine. I want them to mind their business. I don't identify as trans. I identify as male. However, mm -hmm. you know, I just feel like I want people to be a little bit more sensitive to the subject for people that are sensitive about that kind mm -hmm. of stuff. True. Mm -hmm. Because there are people that do have, you know, these hairstyles or these looks, softer faces or softer voices. Right. And people are just feel they're like they're beautiful. so open mm -hmm. to like ask a question like that right mm -hmm. even though it's not in a, they don't mean to be offensive right a lot of times it is kind of offensive like you don't want to be asked i guess you're it's more just like questions. right it's like right. you're, you're not right. in my business right right well, i got my nails and my hair and my other right. stuff but whatever. a lot of times they're not even asking for the reasons as far as like you would think they're asking a lot of them are <laughs> Oh, oh, do we need to watch the tea? <laughs> Don't it. Mm -hmm. Tell it, tell it. You know, it's just weird to me. Like, I, in my experience, I don't know about anybody else that had this experience, but in my experience, when I had the hair, you know, the wigs and things like that, a lot of people did ask me because a lot of, <laughs> a lot of guys actually, I don't want to say a lot. The ones that I've encountered have fantasies about transsexual women mm -hmm. and therefore they ask me that because really? I'm their they want me to be their fantasy wow is it weird to be thought of as a fetish I don't like that I don't I like that well because you're say. human it's because like you're, you're not make, you're doing a play you yeah know? you're trying to put me in a box as right. a freak mm -hmm. kind of yeah. so like I'm a it's like not a, a show some yeah, way some right. 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 right but you'd be surprised how many men love this Mm -hmm. Oh, it's a whole. Oh, but they know. Um, that's a, look, surprised. that's a whole nother show. That's gonna true, be coming. True, out. true, true. But I feel like one, they should mind their business, right? And I feel like even with the kids today, if your kid is leaning towards straight, is it leaning towards gay, or is it leaning towards trans? I think you're gonna know in the beginning and let them just be there and just be a support for them throughout the whole thing. I don't understand the confusion thing in my. As far as like when people say that, um, is it going to confuse the kids? Mm -hmm. You know, for example, if they look at Okay, Santana, what's going to confuse the kids? Like sexuality? Yeah, like okay. how we were bringing up Santana okay. earlier. Mm -hmm. For example, they see Santana. If they, in their mind, they like don't it. like it, 
they're not going to be confused about it. Yeah. Ooh, I'm not drawn to that. Just yeah. like how kids are not drawn to vegetables. Yeah. If they don't like vegetables, they're not going to like it. Mm-hmm. They're not going to be confused about eating a vegetable by seeing a new vegetable. Yeah. Or one that looks different. That's a great they just don't like that. it. Right. That's beautiful. That is great. How yeah. You said that. But it's just like, you know, I just don't find anything confusing. There's nothing confusing. I look at straight all day long. Right. All day long. And don't nothing confuse me. Even when I was growing up. I guess a question me. for me when you say that thinking as a kid mm-hmm. when it comes to con- right for when it comes to confusion my only question would be like i said again not even addressing the total sexuality i'm just talking about the appearance when a when a a child may be wanting to come out mm-hmm. you know what i mean do are they going to look at it and say I have to be half this way and half that way to be accepted. And, and no, because there's like so many different. You know what? People. But you, do you get what I'm saying? Would it be something confusing? Like I want to be a woman, so do I do? You know, do I go half in? Because he looks like he's half in one way and half in one the other. Mm-hmm. So are they? You know what I'm saying? You get but what I'm saying? But there's sometimes when when they are uh, like for him, mm-hmm. they love everything about being a man. They just are. They love everything about the material For him, part. Yeah. He, the material he part. He's very comfortable with that part. All, all it is is just yeah. material, right? We got our yeah. nails on, we have our hair. Right. People ask me if I want to be a woman right. all the time. I'm like, no, I will not Right, and he, a, a lot of them love being a man. And there's right. only a little bit, a handful, I feel like, that'll cross over and go all the way in, right? Right. But usually, like, I think if he likes, if he has a beard, yeah. he likes being a man. He okay. likes everything about it's just the accessories that are popping off. Right. And I don't think for, I feel like he's very comfortable with And I feel like for a kid it's too. And then for a kid it's either like, you know what, there's somebody that's like me. If I'm thinking this way as a kid, there's somebody like me and there's many there's this how I right. fit in this group. Right. I don't think they're gonna be confused. I think it might be because of the parents and how the how, how the parents is going to, are going to raise them if they're scared to show and they who show the, who they really the are. ignorance because yeah. they don't know and, they, right. and it's not ignorance because they're stupid it's no. ignorance because they don't know and they this is aren't. a different time yeah. like when it you, is. you guys were growing yeah. up yeah it is definitely oh, different people. it oh, is no. definitely no okay <laughs> <laughs> okay we got it we got to get on to the next <laughs> one and um so we can wrap up this session y'all okay. Why? Seven days a week. <laughs> listen, listen. Can I? Can I be a hundred? Can I be a hundred? And, and, and y'all, I'm, I listen to them. I'm, I'm gonna show my age, okay? When I first saw WAP, I thought it was. <laughs> you know, 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 I first Ooh. thought that Cardi B was singing about the WAP. I'm like, oh, that's coming back. Mm-hmm. No, it's not that WAP. And, and the then I time. heard the song. So how'd you feel about it, sis? Wet Ass Pussy mm-hmm. was a little, it was a little strong. It's a little strong. It's a little strong. We got Kyle. We grew up on, what's her name? Trina. You know what she was well, talking about? We got Kyle. <laughs> Pussy though. Yes, yeah, she did. What did she say, pussy? She got a lot of oh, dogs. No, I. You oh. grew up on Trina. I was MC Light. Okay, me too. MC Light ain't never said pussy. But she. I, listen, <laughs> MC Light. And I don't Queen know. Latifah. I don't know your. I don't know your sexual. Queen Latifah. Okay, but listen, MC Light, Queen Latifah. I'm not sure about MC Life, but they that like was girls. My girl. That was my girl. They like girls and they were tomboy. That was our yeah. tomboy era. Yeah. I, we grew up on TLC. We all yeah. dressed like boys. Yeah. Now sexuality is like. Yep, I got this. And I feel like this. For the WAP song, there's some hoes. I, I think mean, it is. It's, 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 I think there's some hoes. It's, it's the time. time. It's, 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 it's for the time. There's the one over there. It's 25. Ah! 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 Just kidding. <laughs> I said reform. Yeah, I'm dread. You can take your wholeness back after one. Listen, <laughs> took it back. Took it back. Took it back. 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 Fishing pole. I am somebody's mother and a housewife now. <laughs> You she, catch me. She's a household. She's, she's a, she's a household okay. is what she's saying. <laughs> she's a household. A household. <laughs> that sounds like a title for me. Okay. 
a household. You know that whole <laughs> no catching feelings and catching flights. So that's okay. Mm-hmm. Retired. Retired. Oh my god. But I feel like it's the song of its time. Yeah. Right. right. It's that song right. like Little Kim was like she had them songs like <gasps> Little Kim. She was all gonna do it. Like women, women empowerment oh, too. Geez. Women can say and do what about they your want. Pussy? Right. But men can do it all the time. They but do how, it all the time. How come we didn't make a big craze about it when men was talking you know. about it in all the songs? And listen, song. I am, I ain't gonna tell y'all my age. But I'm older than both of them. By a little bit. Not that much. I'm, yes. A little bit. Yes, I'm older. It's a different and time. And you though. just didn't say pussy. Say like, now. you can't. I can say the hell out of it right now. <laughs> I probably just the pussy. It was not because you snatched. Yeah, he said it. Pocketbook snatched. Yeah. 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 Snack. Yeah. Who the cat? Your cooch. Money. Mm-hmm. Everything. <laughs> Put your pocketbook away. Put your pocketbook away. Girl, away. you can't look. What did, what did um, um, Betty Wright say? You can't show your, your feet to every man. <laughs> right. <laughs> right. Like, you can't. Yeah, you I, just, you just I it. heard it. Mm-hmm. And then. It's, it's crazy. Oh, it's it worse was, than saying the F word. Yes. Not now. It's a, it was a little strong. I'm, I'm, Times I'm, are changing, though, with yeah. everything. With. with identification and, and, and genders and and the way we speak to each other, the way we react to things. Like, everything it's taking is taking control changing. of the yeah. I feel like. Yeah, that's what I feel like. It's just taking control. So, you know what? Why you get to talk Women about it? Women mine. Control. I don't know how to work it. <laughs> Wait, so, I why can't I talk about it? Let me tell you what it makes you, what's going to make you feel okay. good. Okay. Right? Women Instead of control, telling me. Oh, yo. Apparently, she didn't put on <laughs> or clean, but she still got that ring. Well, okay. Not no more. She don't want it. But she still got it. She still got it. Right. Still got and it. when I heard that, let me tell you something. <laughs> I told my fiance, I said, you heard this lyrics? She said she don't cook or clean. What? She got a ring. Oh, that's that's him, okay. He don't like, get me what? started. That might have to be a whole nother show. How y'all don't do shit? What is you going on? You know what I mean? I got they my friends. They don't cook. They don't clean. cook. They don't know how to cook. In fact, the man got to go either cook or get them something to eat. They come to a dirty ass house. Mm. And they still get a ring. Well, I will say this. A lot of them are working. They all are CEOs. So I get it. Right? I'm, I'm sorry. Time. Even the traveling ass was one that came in. <laughs> <laughs> I will say that because I got friends that are bosses. And I know they don't have time or whatever. But I like to eat. Shit, I was. So I made listen, sure I learned how to cook. He knows. I was seven days a week. I was a manager. A <laughs> seven, days a <laughs> seven days a week? Yeah. Seven days a week. Yes. Well, y'all, we got to wrap it up. We got to wrap it up. It's Never been real. It. It's been fun. Pussy, 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 pussy. <laughs> There's some holes in this house. Hey, you don't have his hands on TikTok. Okay. I can't get my leg up. Uh-uh. Nobody can do that. No, nobody can do that. And then bring it down with my knees. Baby, I ain't got the oh, time. Look, we don't have time to call the ambulance. Bring, bring, bring the ambulance. Bring the ambulance. I ain't got the time, honey. I ain't got the time. All right, guys, you know what it is.